coming soon to me. No parking in LA. So I'ma send the up you guys and welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Taiki. welcome back if you're not new as y'all see by this title i'm getting a new puppy today so i've been wanting a new puppy for so freaking long especially when i was in college this semester because i used to be so lonely in my dorm but now college is over with and i'm back at home and i was like you know what this is the perfect time to go ahead and get my puppy so that's what we're doing today when i had came back home from school i literally told my mom like i'm want a puppy and she thought I was playing like she thought I was playing I was like no I'm for real like can you please help me find somebody who breeds dogs and has dogs so I can get a puppy and y'all literally two days later she found a breeder here who has the exact puppy that I want and I was freaking so happy I had told her I wanted a Mouty Poo or a Toy Poodle I actually found a breeder here in Atlanta who has Toy Poodles but Toy Poodles are expensive okay he wanted like three thousand dollars for one of them and I was like nah I'm not paying that okay hey I'm a college student okay I'm not paying three thousand dollars for a dog okay so she ended up finding a breeder who has three Mouty Poo puppies they're all boys which is exactly what I wanted. I wanted a boy dog and the price is perfect. He's not charging a whole lot, which is kind of suspicious because it's kind of making me think they might not actually be Mouty Poos. They might be mixed with something else. I don't really know. Two of them are black and one of them is like beige with like black in it. That's the one that I'm getting, the one that I want. But the breeder said he's going to bring all three puppies when we meet him today. Because we're meeting him today a little later on around like four or something. And he said he's going to bring all three of the puppies so I, I can see all of them in person. Even though I already know which one I want. But yeah. I'm so excited. So right now we're actually about to go to PetSmart so that I can start getting some of the stuff, like some of the basic stuff like puppy pads, leash, shampoo, puppy shampoo, all that type of stuff. And then after I get the dog, I'm probably gonna go back to PetSmart to get some other stuff. Once I see how big he is in person, because I gotta see how big he is in person so that I can get him like a little collar, a little, a little shirt or something, a little outfit or something, yeah. And I'm gonna get him a little doggy bed, blanket. I have a whole entire list of everything I'm getting. So that's what we finna do right now. And he's already, the puppy I'm getting is already like, a couple months old i think he's like two months old so yeah i'm just gonna see you guys when i get in the car when we head to pet smart and yeah so i just got in the car y'all i'm so freaking excited this is like my first puppy like my own puppy like you know we have at my house we have two other dogs um we got a small dog a pomeranian and then he's a boy and then we have a big dog um she's a girl she's a golden doodle she's big as fuck if you watch my vlogs i probably showed y'all her but yeah we already have two dogs at the house but this is like my own dog my personal you know my own dog so it's gonna be all my responsibility so i'm excited i'm gonna keep him in my room because like i said we already have two other dogs and they be walking around the house and the girl dog the big one she's like really aggressive and really like she's very playful but she's also really aggressive so i don't really want to have her around him too much yet I'm, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let them all like meet each other so that they know like and they're familiar but she's not finna be she play too much like she's too big and she gonna try to bully him because she be trying to bully our other small dog and she not finna bully my dog okay you not finna bully my dog so I'm just gonna keep him in my room and we have a dog cage that we don't use cuz our dog got too big for it that I'm going to use for him which is great cuz now I don't have to spend money on a dog cage so I'm gonna put that cage in my room and yeah. But I'm just gonna see you guys when we get to um, PetSmart and start getting everything. The breeder told me what type of dog food he has them on, but he orders the dog food. It's not an actual dog food that you can get in the store. You have to order it. But he told me a different brand that was the closest to it, like most similar to that brand. And he said he's gonna give me some of the actual dog food to mix it in because if you know you can't really switch a dog's like food like you can't really switch their food it's gonna mess with like their stomach and stuff so you have to keep them on whatever food they're on 
or if you switching them over to a different type of food you have to do it like slowly like you can't just get them you know so he's going to give me some of the food that he feeds them so that i can mix it in with the other food and then eventually get the dog to start eating the other food i just got to pet smart so we're about to go in here so i'm in pet smart this is all food i don't really know what i'm getting first i'm just walking around right now I'm not gonna buy the food yet till I meet up with the um breeder and he can show me exactly what food to get. Okay, so they have bowls right here. I'm gonna get him his bowls. He's a small dog, so I'm gonna get some small bowls. They got this right here. How much is this? They don't even have a price on it, I don't think. Those are the bowls I picked up. Now I'm gonna get him some chew toys. He needs small ones, cause he's a really small dog. I want to get him at least two um chew toys. I got him this um elephant, cause I just thought it was so cute. And I got him one um chew toy. I'm finna find another one that he might like. Okay, this one says it's for puppies. It says teething and soothing, proper chewing habits, and it's chicken flavored. So I'm gonna get this. I'm looking at um puppy pads. That one says extra large. I'm pretty sure I would need this right here. I don't know. This is like the only kind they have. So this is everything I got so far. I'm finna get the um shampoo. And conditioner I gotta get one that says for puppies mm, they got a lot of them y'all this is so much like <laughs> this is so much stuff I have to get I found the doggy beds I'm gonna find a cute one cute little small one I don't know this is, they don't really have a lot of selections though okay I found this one this one is perfect it's so cute and it's the perfect size what kind of baby you getting? It's a Mountie Poo. Aww. Mm -hmm. Got pictures. Oh yeah. So I just left out of PetSmart. I ended up spending $150 in there. But the lady had gave me the little coupon book. So I ended up saving like 30 something dollars. But now I'm going to go to Target, which is right here, and go get a blanket. I'm going to get him like a little baby blanket because they didn't have blankets in there. So I'm going to just go in Target and get them. And yeah. Hey, you guys. So it's a little bit later on. It's like around 4 o'clock right now. So I ended up getting the stuff that I showed y'all from um, PetSmart. But I'm going to show y'all everything I got. So this is where I put his cage at in my room. It's in like this little corner so that I can see him from my bed and in there I put his little doggy bed and some of his little toys that I got this is the little elephant I think this one squeaks yeah and then this is like the little monsters ink thing Mike I don't think this one squeaks but yeah I put his little toys in a these right here are the um puppy pads that I got I'm gonna lay one down right here next to the um crate and then I got a blanket right here i'm gonna put it in there i got some shampoo puppy shampoo i got him a brush this is like a little chew toy it's supposed to help with dental health so i got him some little treats right here i got this right here which is a stain remover for when he start peeing and pooping all over the place i'm going to clean it up and then i got him a leash and I got some more stuff in this bag. So this is his bowl. So I'm going to put his food and water in. This is just a tag I ripped up on the toys. Y'all, this is what his blanket looks like. I just laid the puppy pad right there. And everything is all in here. But like I said, we finna go. So I'm just going to see you guys when we get in the car. It's like a 30 minute drive from here. So... I just picked up my puppy right here. He looking around. He trying to see what's going on. He's a boy. Even though I got him on this pink blanket, he's a boy. But y'all, yeah, his name is Ace. He's so cute and small. 
He's scared. It's okay. She need to drive slow. We finna go to PetSmart right now and get the rest of the stuff that we need. Baby. And this we finna go. Here. Yeah. I got a grandbaby. Hey y'all, so I'm sorry I did not vlog earlier after I had seen y'all in the car. We had to run into PetSmart, then the drive home took forever, and then we got here, and I was just tired. But when we got here, I took him outside. He didn't use the bathroom outside. He actually peed in here, <laughs> but it's okay. Um, I let him meet the two other dogs. One of the dogs, the small dog, he was cool, but I told y'all the big dog, she just don't know how to act, so I can't have her around him. But ever since then, we just been taking naps, laying down. I tried to get him to eat some of his food. He had a little bit. And right now, it's like nine something. I'm finna take a shower because he been laying with me in my bed, but I gotta go take a shower. And it was like earlier, every time I would like walk away from him, leave from him, he would start whining and crying, which is why I had him in the bed with me. But now he's in a cage well in the crate only because i gotta take a shower and i don't want him just on the bed because he might fall off and i don't want him just walking around the room by himself unattended so i just put him in a crate real quick there he go i'm sorry baby i'm sorry i had to put you in the cage oh, i'm sorry go baby stay stop i'm sorry it's tail wagging he want to get out so bad i'm sorry i'm gonna let him out when i get out of the shower and then um take him outside see if he gotta use the bathroom and yeah, see he crying now. Y'all hear him? He crying. I gotta go. What's that? We're outside right now. He right there. Come on, you gotta come potty. You wanna play? You wanna play? Yeah, you wanna play? <laughs> you <laughs> you wanna play or you just chasing me? You wanna play? Oh, he just chasing me. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> I'm trying to get you to party. He's so cute. He like, girl. I'm not gonna keep playing. You go come over here. Yeah. You're such a cute boy. So right now we're upstairs in my bed. We finna lay down. He didn't potty outside, but I'm gonna end up taking him out again. Probably in like, I don't know how long. This is the pink blanket I had in my lap when I picked him up, so I just kind of been keeping it around him. Tell everybody good night. Say bye. Say bye. Oh, he's telling y'all bye. Not really, but. <laughs> hey, good morning, y'all. So it is the next day. It's like 8 o'clock in the morning. Excuse this bonnet that I have on. I really just got up. But anyways, let me show y'all Ace. Ace, you want to say hey? Look, you want to say hey? You can't eat my shoes. You can't eat my shoes. I actually just took him outside and he did number two outside. He hasn't used the bathroom in the house yet, which is so good. But right now we finna go to Starbucks. Well, I'm finna go to Starbucks, but I'm bringing him with me because he got to come with me everywhere, okay? Not everywhere, but he gonna come. And we just been up playing because he's such a good boy because he used the bathroom outside. He's so sweet, like, he's so sweet. He just want to play. Like, he just want to play. So we in line at Starbucks, Ace with me. He just been sitting in my lap. He actually been fine. Like he ain't been crying, whining or nothing. He just been chilling in my lap. Right? Look, he actually falling asleep right now. He's so cute. I brought his blanket just because. Yep, he just chilling. He is just chilling. Good morning, y'all. So it's the next day. I'm sorry I haven't been like vlogging every single day consistently. It's been so much going on. But it's the next day and it's like 7 o'clock in the morning. I just got up. Well, we just got up. Here's Ace this morning. Ace, say hey. Say hey. Say hey. <laughs> y'all, this is where he sleeps Um, in my bed. And I always keep his little toy right there. Y'all, last night he slept the entire night. Because the first night he had like, um, kept like waking up in the middle of the night wanting to like play and stuff. But nah, last night he was sleep the whole night, y'all. I was so happy. He was sleep the whole night. He woke up one time at like 4 o'clock in the morning, but he went right back to sleep. So yeah, I was so freaking happy. And he did not pee in the bed at all. 
So since he's up now, we about to go outside. I'm finna take him outside so that he can go use the bathroom. He's actually really good with using the bathroom outside. Like he has not used the bathroom in the house, not once. Besides when I had first brought him here and I put him in his own crate and he had peed. But that was it. He's really good with using the bathroom outside, like literally. But we finna go outside. We finna go outside. And then when we come back inside, I'm gonna go ahead and let him eat for the morning. Oh, let's go. I need a jacket, cause I feel like it's cold outside. Where's my jacket? We outside right now. I had, I've been taking him out to the front yard because when we had first brought him home, we took him to the backyard, he didn't do nothing. But every time I bring him to the front yard, he always uses the bathroom. Go Patty, Ace. Go Patty. He finna go, I can tell. Yeah, he's such a good boy. He peeing right now. He pee like a, a girl dog, but it's because he's so small. But I can tell that he peeing. Y'all, he taking a dump. He's so smart. Oh my gosh, I love him. He's so smart. You gotta be patient. Oh, I'm not gonna show y'all. You gotta be patient because he be getting distracted. You gotta keep him focused. I just keep on telling him go potty and move him in different spots and eventually he gonna go. You such a good boy. Yes, you is. You such a good boy. You such a big boy. Ah! Oh, you okay? You such a big boy. You potty outside. So we back in my room. I just gave him some fresh water and food. He really only eat when he ready to like. Sometimes I'll feed it to him out my hand and he'll eat it out my hand like that. Yeah, like he be eating out my hand. But he eat out the bowl too if he hungry. He might not be hungry right now. So I made him an appointment for tomorrow to go to the vet for his first um little puppy visit. So he gonna go tomorrow um in the morning. Um, They said it's a drop off thing. So I drop him off in the morning and get him in the afternoon he gonna be whining so bad y'all i'm trying to crate train him because it's gonna be times where i might need to go somewhere and he might have to be in a crate for a little minute or i might be having to do something and he might need to be in a crate usually if i have to do something my mama or maybe one of my brothers or my sister will watch him but if they can't watch him he's gonna have to go in the crate so i've been letting him have a little bit of crate time every day just a little bit and of course he he's going to whine and cry and scream until i let him out okay he's going to try to get out but usually i only put him in there when i need to like take a shower or when i need to eat and there's nobody who can watch him at the moment but it's just a little bit every day so that he can get used to it because he's gonna have to get used to the crate like he's not gonna be in there all day but sometimes he's gonna have to be in the crate if i gotta do something or whatever show them what you were finna do little boy See, he eat a little bit of his food and then mind his business and go do what he want to do. Did his elephant toy. He love playing with this. But y'all, everybody love him. Like, everybody at the house love him. My mama love him. My brother and sister love him. Everybody love him. So, I'm about to take a shower. So, I just put him in a crate while I get in the shower. Y'all hear him crying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's only going to be for a minute so I can take a shower. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't just let you walk around the room by yourself. Good morning, y'all. I look crazy. I just look crazy, but <laughs> it's the next day. Um, Today is his first vet visit. It's at 8.15. It's like 7 o'clock right now. He was up. He got up at like 6.30, and he was just up. So I just took him outside. He just peed. He didn't do anything else. And now I'm going to let him eat and run around and play. Because in the morning, when he get up, he's ready to play, okay? But there he go. He eating some of his food right now. He getting more comfortable with the crate. Not actually being in there, but he'll go in there to get his food. So it's, you know. And y'all, he love looking at himself in the mirror. Like, literally. He love looking at himself in the mirror. He gets so excited when he see himself in the mirror. He's like, oh my gosh, what is a handsome man? Who is that? Who? Who is he? He trying to bite my robe. He just wanna, he just wanna chew on anything he can. Hey guys, so it's a little later. Um, me and Ace pulling up to the vet for his appointment. We are a little late, but it's okay because it's okay. We had things to do, but we just get in here. So I'm finna park my car so that we can go in here. 
really quick and he just chilling on my lap hey you guys so i just dropped him off at the vet i had to drop him off it wasn't one of them vet appointments where you sit there with them actually while they getting everything done i had to drop him off and they said i can pick him back up well he'll be ready around 11 and it's nine o'clock right now so that's not too bad he's not gonna be there that long he was being such a good boy he was being so good just sitting in my lap he wasn't crying or whining or nothing he was just chilling just sitting down and they took him away i'm so sad i'm so sad i didn't want him to go but yeah he was being good the whole time so y'all you know, get him in a couple hours and let me tell y'all having a pet is expensive i already knew that though but i'm just restating it having a pet is like having a child having a baby okay but i love him and he's made me so happy and i miss him already hey y'all so it's 10 47 and the vet just called and said that he's ready to be picked up so i'm gonna go pick up my baby she had told me he probably would be um ready earlier than 11. So yeah, I'm finna go get him. And y'all, please ignore my lashes because I know my lash is coming up. I I see it, I know. I'm not worried about it right now. I'ma glue it back on later. I can't worry about it right now. Y'all yeah, just need to chill on me, okay? I been, I been, yeah, okay? I'm a new mom. I'm not worried about no lashes. <laughs> hey! So y'all, we're back at home from the vet. Um, I had a coupon, so it took the price down. Originally, it was like two something, and it brought it down to one something. They said he was so talkative. I'm already knowing <laughs> he was probably just whining. <laughs> but he's doing good. They say everything looked good, and I scheduled his next appointment. He was just asleep, but as soon as I got up, because I got up to grab my laptop because I'm going to edit. As soon as I got up, he got up. But he finna lay down and go back to sleep. We watching the um Little Mermaid, the original one. But he finna lay down and go back to sleep. I know he's tired. As soon as we got home, he was just ready to lay down. Right? Right? Mm-hmm. I'm telling y'all, this is where he sleeps every single night. On this pink blanket right next to me. Every night, whenever he ready to take a nap. This where he be, right here, where he be, right under me. So while he sleep, take his nap, I'm finna edit. Works out perfect, cause as long as he not trying to play, because if he ready to play, he will not sit right here. He is going to try to jump off the bed. And I don't have time for that because he's too small and I don't want him to get hurt. Hey y'all, I don't know when the last time I seen y'all to be honest. I think it was earlier when I got him from the bed but i don't really remember but he right here eating his dinner <laughs> this is the last time he gonna eat for the night so he just over here eating tell him hey say oh what you eating you eating the food or you eating something else i'm gonna be so happy when he is ready to go to sleep okay i'm gonna let him eat he gonna run around and play then Then, I'm going to take him outside. He going to get to... Boy, can I talk to them without you being in my camera? But like I was saying, after he run around and play and I take him outside so that he can use the bathroom, night, night, time to go to sleep. <laughs> okay, I'll make sure he get good and tired, which I feel like he probably won't because he's actually been like taking naps all day. Ever since I got him from the bed, he's been taking naps all day. So, I feel like he's going to have all the energy tonight. And I just want to go to sleep. Okay? I just want to go to sleep. And I can't go to sleep unless he's asleep. Because if I'm sleeping, he's up. He's going to be getting into stuff he shouldn't be getting into. Trying to jump off the bed. I can't just leave him on the floor by himself. Because then, like I said, he's going to try to chew on stuff he's not supposed to be chewing on. Doing a whole bunch of stuff. I can't leave him unattended. So... Really, I go to sleep when he go to sleep. And then if he wake up in the middle of the night, I, I'm up in the middle of the night. When he wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning, I'm up at 6 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Please don't wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. Please don't. Please just stay asleep all night. Like, please, be, just wake up at like 9 and we'll be good, okay? 
but we gotta be there tomorrow. We're going somewhere tomorrow, me and Ace. Uh, it's not gonna be in a vlog though. I'm gonna just put it in a separate video. This was just supposed to be like the first few days with him, so that's gonna be in a whole different video. I'm gonna get him some more chew toys because he seems to like these little stuffed animals more than anything. Cause I have some more, but I think they're too like um, what you gonna call it, hard. I'm gonna show y'all. He'll chew on this one. He been chewing on this one a little bit, but that green one, no. He loves these little um stuff things that I got him. So I'm gonna get him some more of these. Probably like two more so that he can have some more of them to play with. But yeah, I'm gonna just let him play so he gets tired. I'm trying to get him to be not so dependent on me or on anybody because he doesn't like to be alone. So that's gonna be difficult trying to get him to be alone because he does not like to be alone. Show them what you just doing. so cute hope that y'all enjoyed this video because now i'm a dog mom and i hope y'all enjoy meeting y'all nephew because it's y'all nephew okay look at y'all nephew but like i was saying i hope y'all enjoyed this video if you was new to my channel if you've never been to my channel it's your first time seeing me um go ahead and subscribe like hello if you think about getting a puppy Go on to get one, okay? Go on to get one. Just know they a lot of work, okay? But y'all gonna be seeing more of Ace. Y'all gonna see him um grow, get bigger. And yeah, and I just wanna say thank y'all so much for watching. And make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And I'ma see you guys in my next video. I'ma let him tell y'all bye. Say them bye. Say bye. Say bye. Say bye. Oh, my God. he's supposed to be saying bye. He going crazy, <laughs> little boy. <laughs> he is tearing an elephant up. All right, bye, y'all. We gotta go. Okay, see y'all next time.